Uh, welcome. Uh, so we have a special uh, guest speaker today. His um, name is uh, Gregory Gentile. Yes. Right. Um, and he is uh, demonstrating his product. So as you know, you know, if you watch TV, Tennis Channel, um, pros will have this challenge system, right, uh, called Hawkeye. Um, so if it's like the ball's out, they challenge it. Mm -hmm. So his device is actually pretty similar, right? It, it detects uh, all the lines, in calls and out calls, and uh, it'll make beeps and, um, and it's really a remarkable invention. Oh, also, led, and, yeah. but definitely this is more to, to tell you if the ball is in or out. Okay. Yeah. So uh, very similar to what you oh. see on TV. Mm -hmm. Uh, the idea was to do something similar to what you see on TV, but inexpensive. Mm -hmm. uh, you can buy it and you can install it on any tennis court. Uh, so you see that I can show you this. Uh, so this is a device the way uh, it comes. You see that you have two cameras. So it's a camera based system. Uh, you have this uh, strap. So you just need to, uh, to strap the uh, device around the uh, net post like this. Okay, the first thing that you need to do is to calibrate. So the device needs to know where the court, uh, the court is. Uh, so I can do this uh, very, very uh, quickly. Uh, it takes just a few seconds and you just need to do this only once. Okay, and once he has uh, calibrated, uh, he's going to know where the uh, uh, lines are. And now he's going to, uh, to call the, uh, the balls. So if uh, we can play with someone, all right, uh, who wants to play? Who wants to play? <laughs> play, we win, we win. You're up. We win, go. Go. So when the ball is in, you see that you have a green light. You see the green light on the green device. Uh -huh. And when the ball, let me uh, put the ball out. When the ball is out, you have a red light and you have a single beep. So you knew that your ball was uh, going uh, out. Okay, so it doesn't have to be a challenge. It's just exactly. So Exactly, this is really the point to have something in real time and you don't need to go to the device. Okay. You have the instant beep to know if the ball was uh, out. Okay. If you uh, don't trust the device or you think that perhaps the ball was in, whatever, you can go to the device and you can review the ball bonds. So I don't know if you want to come or just to, uh, to see the, the, the screen. You see that the, uh, uh, you have the, uh, the view oh, of the yeah. ball bouncing. Yeah. Oh, you can see. Right. You can yeah. it for singles cool. or doubles? Yes, so you can do both singles and doubles. So obviously here I, it was for singles mm -hmm. because I was just playing singles. But you can also do for, uh, for, for, for doubles. So you see that you have the review mm -hmm. of, the, uh, of the ball bounce to know that the, the ball was... So yes, so he's going to call the baseline and the sideline uh, in practice mode. So we can continue the, the demo. So now we are going to do match mode. Okay, match mode, so uh, still my partner. All right, we win. You're still one. in. You're great. number one. You're a great demo. Uh, on the ad side? Yep. On the ad side. So now match mode, so he's going to recognize that I'm serving. Out. Wow. So you see the beep, the ball was out, it was, uh, because it was a serve out. So you can decide, so it depends, you have all kinds of settings. So this is a good question. So for instance, you can do the full sound and in the full sound is going to beep once when the ball is in and multiple times when the ball is out so let me show you this so let's just do one more uh, it, uh, yeah. good Oh, that's oh. out. So, a little yeah. bit more noise. Yeah. Okay? Too much noise. <laughs> there is something else that is also interesting, is that you can do um, training mode. What? In training mode, uh, it means that you are going to define custom zone where that you need to hit. Like, so like working with a ball machine. Hey, for instance, working with a ball machine. So here, we are going to do cross court. Mm -hmm. So you need to play, you, you are in there. Thank you. And we need to play cross court. Just to show you. So, if I play here, yeah, there is a beep because I'm over the service line. 
If I do on this side, there is no beep because I did not manage to play in this zone. Okay? And if it's too short, like this, it is not going to... Uh... Don't go backwards, don't go backwards. Sorry. So let's, go let's do it. You are going to understand. Good. So it didn't beep because it was too short. Too short. Oh, that Get it deep. Get it. Get it deep. That's what we did last time. Oh, good angle though. Okay. <laughs> and it's even going to do the percentages. So you are going to know which percentages you manage to do. Yeah. And even going to give you your ITR, instant tennis rating. Meaning that it's going to tell you your USTA rating for this, uh, for this uh, exercise. Oh, oh. No. so it must be five O's. Six O's. And everything is on the uh, device and then you will be able to synchronize with the cloud. Uh -huh. And in the cloud you have access to all your statistics. So all your uh, past uh, history of statistics together, you are going to get, uh, to get this kind of uh, information in the cloud. Even the device can give you the best strategy to beat an opponent. So let's say that we play together a few times with the device. The device is going to analyze the way I'm playing against this opponent and this opponent is playing against me. No, that's and it's going to make you why well, you have to practice. Why well, you have to improve. And it's going to give me the best strategy to beat this specific opponent. Oh. Yeah. Exactly. So the idea is that I really wanted to have something standalone. So you don't need a phone, you don't need a tablet, whatever. You just have to put the device on the, uh, on, on the net post. Then you can synchronize when you are at home with your phone and your tablet, access all the cloud, all this information. But on the tennis court, you don't need the, uh, the, the phone, you just need the, the, the device on the, uh, on, on the net post. Mm. Okay, uh, so this is one device. With one device, you have you can record video. You can also record the video. So if you want to watch your video playing uh, on the you tennis court, record my video like uh, if I want to record for how I'm playing. My he record all the time. So all the all, all the time when we were playing, uh, you have a micro SD card. So you can put the uh, uh, micro SD card, and it's going uh -huh. to record on the micro SD card. Yes, so there is a, uh, I'm not going to stop it, but yes, there is a removable battery. So two hours, two hours battery life for, uh, um, when the battery is fully charged, two hours uh, and you can remove it from the device. All right. Okay. And then it works at night with lights. And, yeah, uh, so good uh, light condition. Probably uh, I've never tried mm. on this one, but those ones it seems mm. a good, uh, good one. So mm. definitely it should, uh, mm. it should work uh, uh, with, uh, with, with the device. Okay. Mm. And uh, can you mention like all the things that, uh, uh, how much it is, the, you know, what you need to purchase, uh, optional stuff, etc. So once again, one device for a starting point is definitely a, a good thing. Two hundred fifty dollars. So you see, we uh, I try to balance something that is not too expensive, but you still have a lot of uh, uh, electronics. So this is what uh, justify the, the price of, uh, of the device. I really wanted to have the price of a tennis racket. A very, very good tennis racket. The idea was to have the, the same price for the device as a very good uh, tennis, uh, tennis racket. So $250 for, uh, for one uh, device and uh, another $250 if you want to put a, a, a second device to get better uh, reliability and better uh, accuracy. Oh, I have a question. So why did you invent this? Uh, what made you uh, think about doing it? It was really to mm. see on TV the Hawkeye system. So you see when you see on TV the challenge, the, mm. uh, the calls, uh, is definitely something that is very, very mm. interesting on TV. And I really wanted to offer this to any uh, tennis player. It's very difficult to make a calls. I mean, when you are here and you need to take a look at the, yeah, the ball no very way. close to the, to the baseline, it's or even when you are hitting the ball and you are not really taking a look at the, at the lines, it's very difficult to make your own call. So this is exactly the point. All right. So uh, thanks again, uh, Gregory. I'll email out all the information. Uh, Gregory. Gregory. Yes. Gentil. Uh, thanks again. Amazing product. Um, and uh, thank you. Thank you. Look forward to more updates and more things from you. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at topspinadrian, and check out some of my other videos. See you next time.